Inside. One. When I was a child, a man came to tune our piano. It was the first time I thought about climbing inside. He showed me, with his stranger's voice and ways, how the hammers hang in tight arrays, ready to leap to the sounding strings, to make music come from the keys. When the lid was closed and the man was gone, they reverted to mocking cacophony. The longing began and grew to touch in the dark of the wooden guts the harp that I knew was there, to tangle my fingers, my throat, to show that I was as much its slave as he. Two. A book falls open, and I remember Corde Tendenie, straining threads that stretch inside our hearts like pink harp strings that a child, in the wine dark of some Christish ventricle gestating or dying, could play. Three. My father's heart upset me, so I cried. Those hours on the table. He was proud. I had so many times explained it to him, he to me, they to us. A cut in the groin, stiff line fed in, poked progress through the centre of him to the glow on screen. The switch, the flash, the rebel silenced forever, the dizzy syncopator. He sits at the table now, lub-dubbing one time per second. That whinging thing inside turned back to ridiculous blood, its song drowned out by the thud of sinus rhythm.